Hey, CHE, have a great Wednesday. I'm sorry, I mean Wednesday. Today is Wednesday, March 20th, 2024. Today is cycle day four. Again, there's no upcoming events this week, but next Friday, I'm looking forward to a great spring break. Today, the Christina Huddleston weather report is partly cloudy with a high of 31 and a low of 16. Brr, it's getting cold out this week. Today for lunch is a soft shell chicken taco with fresh fixings and fiesta black beans, fresh veggies and assorted fruit, and a chocolate ice cream sundae cup. Option two is an egg and cheese garden salad. But actually tomorrow for lunch is a breaded chicken, filet buttered noodles and roasted carrots. Option two is a brunch box. Tomorrow for breakfast will be cinnamon toast crunch soft baked bar. Today for book checkout is Mrs. Story, Mrs. Spores, Mrs. Troy, Mrs. Otto, Mrs. Forrester, Mrs. Rowan, and Mrs. Flavin's class. Wishing a special happy birthday today to one in fourth grade. Happy birthday! Happy birthday! Don't forget that the MCA testing will be for all fifth graders. So please keep quiet in the fifth grade hallway if you have STEM or art. It will only be in the morning time. So if you see any fifth grader, make sure you wish them a good luck and to try their best. Thanks for your help, everyone. Check it out. Now available at the school store, new items. Make sure to stop by every Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday. Today, the third graders will be gone. They'll be having fun at, the learn, at their learning trip at the Science Museum. Our cooperation quote of the month is from Walt Disney. Probably sounds a little familiar, huh? Walt Disney helped bring us Disneyland, Disney World, and Disney movies. He said, Whatever we can accomplish belongs to our entire group, a tribute to our combined effort. In this quote, he is saying that when we accomplish something, it means that we had to cooperate with others and we can all celebrate the accomplishment together. I challenge you to think about a time that recently when you accomplished something in a group. What was each person's part in that accomplishment? It's What in the World Wednesday. So please enjoy this big headed mole rat learning about this interesting animal. The amazing big headed mole rat. The big-headed what? Mole rats, darling. You really must pay attention. Oh, sorry. I was just stunned by the sheer size of your noggin. The big-headed mole rat can be found in Ethiopia, Africa, which is... Oh, where is it? Here, darling. Somebody's not good at geography. Ah, yes, there it is. Up in Ethiopia's Bale Mountains, you can find this rather freaky-looking... Hey, I heard that! I mean, extremely handsome-looking creature. Yeah, that's better. What makes this species different to regular mole rats is that they mainly forage for food above the ground. There is, of course, a good reason why these mole rats... Uh, attractive big-headed mole rats, darling. Oh, sorry. It's because the big-headed mole rat is considered rather yummy by the Ethiopian wolf. Oh, come on. We're not afraid of those creatures. there's one behind you. Oh! <laughs> Got you. How dare you? Anyway, we're still more attractive than you humans. That's silly. I hope you enjoyed that little mole rat. Don't forget the way to be at CHE. Be kind, be responsible, and be safe. 
take the lunch basket down and take attendance and have a wonderful Wednesday, everyone. <laughs>